Hello, 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 and welcome to a brand new Gomer Play series, Monster Party! <laughs> All throughout the month of October, I'll be playing this game. Uh, there's only going to be eight episodes, because there's eight stages, so it's going to be great, it's going to be fun. This goes back to my childhood, man. It's like, like, first time I played this game, I actually borrowed it from a friend of mine, who uh, lived not too far down the road from me, and this was fun as fuck. You can see, and, and as I'm talking, you see some of the bosses that you can actually see throughout the game. Um, yes, these are actual bosses. Yes, that was just shish kebab that walked by just about a few seconds ago. So, yeah, we'll be fighting a whole shit, of shit ton of bosses like this. It's gonna be fun. Um, <laughs> oh, but yeah, these, this is gonna be up on the weekends all throughout October, at least through Halloween. That's how I've got it planned, at least. Um, two videos a month, at least until Halloween weekend, which the last one will go up then. Um, Onion ring, shish kebab. Let's go. Mark was walking home from a ball game. He looked up and saw a bright star. While he stared at it. While he stared at it. Um, isn't that supposed to be a comma there? Ah, uh, and also the scrolling. Oh my god. The star got bigger and bigger. The beauty of the star made his eyes moist, so he didn't notice that the star fell and landed right in front of him. It sounds like somebody that wrote something just to put, just to make a few quick bucks on Amazon Kindle, or with the Amazon Bookstore, whatever, whatever it's called. It wasn't a star, but a monster. Mark quickly asked, Who are you? Mark? No, that is not the proper response when a winged, beaked monster, like, like, humanoid griffin type thing, falls in front of you. The proper response is... Ah! That is the proper response. I'm... I'm Bert. What's up? Again, that's not the proper response. <laughs> I'm looking for help. Evil monsters are out of control in my world. Come and help me. I am afraid to fight the monsters. Well, the evil monsters. Yeah, you can tell I've played this before. Don't worry. With your weapon, you'll be able to destroy them easily. Period. <laughs> this isn't a weapon. It's a bat. Son, son, have you not played any other video game ever? Bats, bats are a viable weapon. Bat, batter, anything is okay. Anyhow, let's go. Bat batter. Battest. Bert grabbed Mark's hand and flew away. What's your name? Mark. Mark, my planet is dangerous. So we must act together. How? Like this. Then they fused together. Hey, the first fusion. This is how Mark's adventure began. By fusing with a monster. Round one. By the way, yes, this was an actual Nintendo game. Look at all the blood. This got past the censors of Nintendo of America. Okay, so you have Mark. You can walk, you can run. As you saw, I can deflect things. You can even hump the ground a little bit. Which is weird. Well, it's a weird look, but, you know, it, it's good for crawling. Whoop. Hearts naturally give you energy. Hi, how you doing? Now the object of each level is to go into as many doors as you can, fight these bosses, and get the key. That's that's pretty much it. Hi! A lot of bosses can be taken out with Mark because, well, hey, they shoot shit at you. They shoot shit that will allow you to just hit them back to them. Fun fact. Fun fact, in the Japanese version, I think it was just a beta version. Th this guy was like actually kind of a more of a uh, nod to Audrey II. <laughs> in fact, if you notice I'm why I'm, how I'm standing there, that was supposed to be like a, a speaker or something. Feed me! I thought you were inanimate. Oh, I look inanimate to you, punk! Hey! Or I can just do this. Boom! There you go. You get an item, sometimes question marks give you anything from points to life to extra... well... 
extra pill power. What's pill power? Well, we're gonna find out in just... Ah, what the hell? That almost hit me. I have, I have no idea what those boys are supposed to be. Are they on fire? Are they electrified? There's a heart. That's what I need. You get only one life. Oh, here we go. Pills make you transform into Bert. Bert can fly, shoot things. His shots change between stages. But it only lasts a limited time. So... Hmm. Eh, and a lot of these rooms are empty. It's a lot of trial and error. I remember I remember most of them. Um, so so most of the game is it's gonna be rather easy for me to remember. Um, da -da 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 -da. just fly, fly, fly. I'm running out. Oh no! Do not be over the spikes. Spikes aren't fatal, but they still hurt a lot. Sorry, I'm dead. Then how the fuck you talking? It's here to just waste your time. I'm gonna run out of Bert. Oops! <laughs> just as I run out. Good. Whoop. Okay, whatever. Let's move on. No, I don't know about. I don't know what those legs are either. But you know, this doesn't look very creepy and monstery. You know, it lo looks a little happy and, and all of that good stuff. You know, that's it looks fine. And then, oh shit! Now we get to the horror. <laughs> Oh god! Skulls everywhere! This is the first level! And this was back in 89, by the way. Hi! Nope. The the famous Jontron nope, so much nope, dog. <laughs> yeah, that's just no. Uh. And big eyeballs with with, with tentacles. Hentai fanat hentai fanatics are, are, are creaming themselves right now. Because, you know, why not? A big giant eyeball with tentacles. Please don't pick on me! Oh yeah, it's a mushroom dude. He says don't pick on him when he comes and tries to kill you. Ah! Sometimes, you just gotta get in there and beat the shit out of people with a bat. That's the lesson I'm taking out of this today. Is just... Oh yeah, there you go! And I got the key! With the key, I go to the end of the level, which is gonna be... Most, pretty much all the way, all the way to the right, at, at every level. And okay, here you go. Hi, hi, how you doing? Woo! There we go. That water is dangerous. You, you hop in that water, you will lose life, and you could die. So you don't want to jump in the water. And this, um, are you okay, dude? I mean, like, did you like? Have fun. Earn your red wings and shit. And if you don't know what earning your red wings are, um, Google it. Ow! Okay, so I have the key. That means I don't need to go in any other doors. Sometimes empty rooms will have, like, different goodies or what have you, but usually it's just there to waste your time. Whoop. And yeah, those hands, those used to be spikes. Oh, God. All right, and another empty room. Yeah, there's one level, and, and I'll note it when we get to it. There's actually one level where uh, there's two bosses you have to beat for the key, and if you beat the third one, then you lose the key. I'll let you know when we get there. Yee! Get a boost of life, and you get a password. Yes, this was back in the days of the password. Holy shit. So that was stage one, area one, all that good stuff. Uh, level one, whatever the fuck it's called. It's the first one. So, yeah, that was, that was pretty easy to get in. I, I almost lost it a time or two, but I'm also a little rusty, so, you know. You know, if you're playing through for the first time, I wouldn't recommend being so reckless. <laughs> but, you know, that's just me. So, uh, yeah, that's it for this one. Uh, next time, we're going to go with level two. That's going to be great. Um... So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this, you know, you can do the usual like, subscribe, comment. Constructive criticism is always appreciated, especially because I really need it, and stagnant water tastes horrible. Oh, wow. So, um, so yeah, and if you want to help in a more direct manner, monetarily, I do have a Patreon, patreon.com slash gomer21xx. 
And for as little as $1 per production, you get things like this at least a day early. And if you become a patron in October, you get all this early. Oh my god, it's more than just one video too, because I upload these in batches. Holy shit. And while she didn't do the title card artwork for this one, um, I do have a title card artist, Becky Hopkins, who is not only an amazing artist and a brilliant animator, she's also my girlfriend. <laughs> So uh, you can check her out at becky-hopkins.com, and don't forget to check out her webcomic Otherworldly, all the links to everything below in the doobly-doo. So with that, thank you guys for watching, and until next time, this is Gomer the Ranting Thespian, uh, signing off. Mm -hmm.